Today I'm going to play around a bit with the Winlink and I'm going to use Vara HF but I'm not going to use HF radio and actually not even going to use the radio for parts of the time here. First up I'm just going to do a verification that I can send mail between my laptops without using a radio which means sending it from the speakers on one of them and over to the other one and then having a return signal via speakers and microphone. That's going to be fun. And then we're going to turn things up a bit and going to switch over to these babies. Uh, some of you may know them. Uh, some of you may think this is heresy. What I'm going to play with today is in this little orange box. And in here it's a pair of uh, Topcom Twin Talk radios. These are PMR radios. Uh, it's similar to what you have in the States with uh, FRS or KDR, other places in Europe. Uh, it's just a license-free FM radio. These are like a bit over the basic ones. Used them a lot in scouts to send out with my scouts uh, so that we could talk to them since they couldn't use ham radio uh, without supervision. So we could send these out and they could uh, practice anything on the radio. Uh, these ones have Vox which means that I can send audio and have this one uh, do the push to talk automatically. So I'm gonna try and see if I can send uh, VARA over PMR. Also like to state that this is legal within Norway. Uh, I did check our laws for this before I sent it just to see if there was any issue with what you sent over PMR. And it's not. You just have to send over a valid radio and it has to be frequency modulated and these ones, they send FM only. This is my setup here. I got my main laptop here and I got the Surface Go over there. And they're both using uh, WinLink with Vara HF. Interesting part when you're sending peer-to-peer, -peer, which I found out while playing around earlier, is that you start a mail message here but you have to send it as a peer-to-peer -peer message and not a winlink message. Otherwise it won't be sent. So this one, uh, this main laptop is set up with uh, LBH4FH-4 and the secondary one is set up with Lima Bravo for Foxtrot Hotel, my main call. Uh, so I'm go just gonna send it uh, to that one, LB4FH. And let's add a small subject, uh, uh, audio, only test. So let's see here. Test and post it to the outbox. Start a new session of VARA HF winning. By default this one drops you into the standard mode. Uh, I don't really need propagation from here to there. So by default it drops you into this standard mode. Just press switch peer to peer. You have to have a dial frequency here and it has to be within a certain range, otherwise it won't do. So I just set it to 1850 uh, on both of them. Everything else is uh, as normal. I've turned off all the radio settings, uh, no push to talk, anything like that. So when I press start now, uh, yeah, channel appears to be busy because I'm talking. So you can hear the radios uh, transmitting to each other. And if I'm talking too much, uh, that will send a, a request or a not acknowledgement. So this is very robust and it will handle that I'm talking all over it. So I got a peak throughput here of uh, 265 bytes per minute. I actually had to put the other laptop out in the car uh, because uh, this uh, mode is so sensitive that it managed to pick up the audio signal through two closed doors and turn down it very low. So yeah, it's outdoors in the car. I'm out in the car now. Uh, radio is set up here on channel one and the laptop is uh, listening. 
For those who haven't operated a radio like this before, it's very simple. Push to talk, volume up and down, lots and lots of DP noises, and just a simple channel selector. I'm using channel 1 for this. It's uh, time to do a test call here. Uh, so I'm just going to press start and see if it picks it up. Nothing unlocks. But there it is. There's no reply. And I do think I know why. Why? Uh, the, um, uh, the box timer is really, really slow. Uh, it does hang for maybe one or two seconds. So that's probably an issue. Uh, I'm gonna go outside and see if there's anything on the radio in the car. As you can see there, uh, the radio outside in the car or the computer was trying to reply, but uh, due to the box hang, uh, it was just blocking the channel. More PMR radios. These are crappy. Uh, these are really cheap. Uh, they're like uh, 20 US dollars for two of them. At least they were when I bought them. Uh, disposable radios, we call them in Scouts. So we didn't care if these ones were broken. The other ones are a lot more expensive. They don't have Vox. So I think I'm gonna have to split this and do one frequency each way. See if that works. Now I got two radios set up here. Uh, channel four on this one and channel one on that one. And let's see if that works. Opposite set up here, channel 4 on this one, channel 1 on that one, and let's see if that works. So that's another problem. Vox on one of these ones seems to be triggering the other radio. So I'm gonna try isolating it, and maybe putting the orange ones uh, within the headset since they have the microphone. So I'm putting this one inside a headset and just moving it off to the side. That did seem promising, uh, but uh, still some issues, but I think that's from this end. Uh, so I'm going to do the same trick here. Uh, I'm going to place these ones within another headset. And I'll see if I can run this more sensitive mic over there and see if that works. Uh, I've got to change uh, sound course settings uh, to headphone and external microphone. And it's working. I didn't have any messages queued up, but it did soon. So let's see if I can send one.
that actually worked. Uh, I wasn't sure about that, but it did. And um, I had to trick around a bit with the two radios each way. Uh, probably some very confused kids around here because these are like normal toy walkie talkies. Uh, it's after their bedtime, so of course they have their radios off. Uh, I think this is a testament to how rugged this protocol is. Like, uh, you can send it over basically junk radios. Like these ones, the disposable ones. Uh, good for reception, but not for very much else. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you found this entertaining. I hope you did not find this as a good way to save your life, because it's not. This is not emergency communications. This is playing around and having fun. Sentry, have a nice day.